What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel, Eat With Coral Blush. Today I've made some lovely minted lamb shanks and to go with them I've got some mashed potato, mashed swede, carrots, broccoli and some Yorkshire puddings. Got my gravy ready here, lovely minty lamb gravy, beautiful. There's the poor guys. Over that lovely lamb. Over the broccoli, some over there. Lovely, beautiful. And for me drink, I have got some orange pop. Lovely jubbly. Put that over there. That's all no doubt need a refill. Cheers, guys. <clears throat> Lovely. Right. Guess what I'm going for first? The mashed potato. Love mash. I whisked it this time so it's extra smooth. Mmm. <clears throat> So it's Sunday. I've had these in the freezer for a while. Well, a few weeks. I thought, oh, lovely Sunday dinner. Make nice minty lamb shanks. They're huge. They're only, um, I think it's 4 99 for two <coughs> in the frozen section. And they come like uh, vacuum packed frozen. You can either do them in the microwave, which if you're only making two, it's easy enough to do. They only take about 11 minutes in the microwave. And they come out so, so tender. Lovely. Or if you want to uh, add more to cook today, so I just put them all in the oven. They take a lot longer in the oven, like. I cook them for about two hours in the oven. But they're just exactly the same, so tender. Because I had a lot to make the day, I just whack them all in the oven together. They just fall to pieces. They're so tender. Mmm. Try some sweet. Are you having a nice Sunday dinner today? Mm. So thirsty today, guys. Some broccoli. Mm. These carrots are lovely. They're already cut like that in a bag. Kenny's absolutely dreading doing this um, <coughs> Carolina Reaper chilli. He says it's going to have to be on a weekend where he hasn't got work because he doesn't fancy having to be on the toilet at work all day the next day. <laughs> have any of you tried it? It was a point blank no from Ellis to do it with him. He just went, no, I don't want to be on YouTube. <laughs> so Ellis won't be doing it. Mm. I'll pick this um, shank up. You can already see it's falling to bits. Watch. Just comes apart. Oh, look, look at that. Clean bone. That's how tender it is. That over there. I forgot to get my tea towel. Oh, there's one there. <coughs> Excuse me. 
excuse me. I just love lamb. Lamb used to always be my favourite meat, but now it's um, beef. I love beef now. Look at that, guys. Mm. Just so tender. So I kept these in the pouches and just cut the corners because they were like vacuum packed. Just so the minty lamb juices fell out and uh, just filled it a little bit of water, the pan. So the minty lamb juices from the pouches went into the water and then once they were, um, had been in an hour, so I took them out the pouches and let all the juices fall out. So this gravy is really nice, guys. Pardon me. Mmm. get loads of meat like one of these do for the kids mm. but someone mentioned these the other day and I thought oh I haven't had them for a while so that's why I bought them Sloppy. A little yolk, yeah. Mm. Back to school tomorrow. This weekend went quite quick. Oh, delicious. <coughs> Pardon me. Bit of a fatty bit there. Look at that, just have to touch it and it just melts apart. Put a bit of turnip, a bit tatty, and eat. I went Aldi with Ellis yesterday. I keep forgetting you want to do like an Aldi vlog, don't you? But I keep forgetting every time I'm in. But anyways, <clears throat> I came back home. Opens the door. The two boys jumping about at the um, front door. with Christmas jumpers on. I come in, the house smelled lovely. Kenny had lit all the um, oil burners. Lit all the candles. And guess what was blasting on the TV? 
Christmas songs. <laughs> now, ski, whoa, and it was that kind of weather, do you know, and it's horrible. It, like, lashed down the rain all day yesterday. Did not give up. And, um... He says, I think we should have a Christmas day of the day and watch Christmas movies. And I says, ooh, well, I um, bought flour and that a couple of weeks ago, just for ready, if I fancied making cakes. So we had some lovely, um, just plain sponge cakes, but then I topped it with um, melted dairy milk chocolate. Bloody lovely they were. So we had a lovely cosy day yesterday. It's just that weather puts you in the mood, doesn't it? Makes you feel Christmassy when it's like gloomy outside and you know Christmas is near I think it's only about be about 11 weeks now because I had a memory on my me, um, phone a few days ago and it said 12 weeks on that day it would have been Christmas Eve I was like whoa <clears throat> I have to start knuckling down and saving for the children hmm Spencer is chopping and changing his mind for his main present all the time. He just went from a VR headset, then he wanted a phone, and then he started talking about a PS5, and he went straight off that idea. So, And then the other day, he's got an iPad. He went, oh, but it's, a, it, it's his iPad, but he uses it for the school, so it's got restrictions on as well, which is good anyway. This is, they have his uh, restrictions. Um, but because Oscar's got the school one and also he had a one before he got his school one, they can, Oscar can like download more games than Spencer can. So he went, I've thought of something for Christmas for like the main present. I went, what? He went, an iPad. I went, you've got an iPad? There's no way on earth I'm going to buy you an iPad just so you can download an extra game. But that game he wanted, he can get on his PlayStation. So like I'm going to buy an iPad for that. They've just found this like VR kind of game on the iPads. It just looks like goggles, but when you move the iPad around, you can see different things. It's like a dinosaur one. And they love that. I went, you like that? You should try the real PS4, like the VR for the PlayStation. I went, you'll have so much fun with that. Um, so he's back on the VR, thank God, because that's what I wanted to get him. And Oscar keeps saying PlayStation, so he's easy. What he's got planned for Halloween? We love Halloween. It'll not be much different apart from you can't go trick or treating. That's the only thing we can't do now. <clears throat> But we'll always like decorate the house and play loads of games anyway, so not be that much different for us. But obviously the kids love trick or treating. But you kinda do that at the minute, can you? Um so like I say, we'll just probably play games and that, eh? Spend hours. And we've got loads of um uh what's it called? Dress ups, like costumes of previous years. Cause Spencer I know what I want to be for Halloween, I went there's no chance I'm going out because I actually had to stop myself when I was out with my nana a couple of weeks ago. When TK Maxx and had brilliant um, costumes for Halloween. And I stopped myself from buying them because I thought, well, can I go out trick or treating? No one's going to see them. I'm not just going to spend like, I think about £17 each. I thought, I'm not buying them just to sit in the house. And I says, no, we can do your face paints or whatever or just use one of the old ones. Because it's not like we can go out. But I've got loads of face paint, so I can, like, well, try and make them what they want to be. Get me artist on. <laughs> I'm getting so full. Then it'll be bonfire night. <clears throat> That's the same. We don't really do now anyway. We just usually have, um like fireworks in the garden and we'll get the barbecue out and we'll do like um schmo like um marshmallows dipped in chocolate and stuff all right that made me um 
and then that's curry or like a big bowl of soup and we just like stay in the garden all night but because like the barbecue is on we just use it like as if it's like a fire pit really but that keeps well warm and from where we live you can see loads of um fireworks in the, in the distance so it's not just ours we look at we can also see loads of, uh, loads of extras <laughs> Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. I thought I had fell there. I thought I had slopped. So I've got um, <coughs> cookie mixes. So I think I might make cookies later on with the boys. Or just make them and <coughs> let them eat them. Didn't take two minutes to uh, knock up some cupcakes, like, I'm getting good. Mm. There she is. I was thinking about getting them again um, but just having them raw you know because they're like uh, when people do wink stop videos they always have like the lovely carrots and celery sticks so I was thinking about getting some um, chicken wings and stuff and doing like a my version wink stop I wish we had wink stop pardon me have this big bit of broccoli and then that's me done get the gravy on I've been um, singing some of the songs off air uh, what's the film called is it the sound of music the hills are alive that one I fancy watching that film now. I don't know how I've been saying. Oh, I've been singing. I am 16 going on 17. I just fancy watching it. I remember I was watching it. Oh, Oscar was just probably a year and a half. He wouldn't take his eyes off the TV. He loved it. I bet they would enjoy it again. If I put it on. Mm. So yesterday we watched Arthur Christmas. And then can he put Krampus on? Have you seen Krampus? I've not actually watched it all the way through. But it's a good idea, I think. Like if you be spoilt and ungrateful. Better than a bag of coal on Christmas. Krampus will come. <laughs> it's quite scary. But I've not actually sat all the way through it. The kids and Kenny love it, but I've not seen it all the way through. Mm. Oh, delicious that, guys. Worth waiting for. I thought I've been trying to take my time because I've been starving. I've literally had nothing all day. What's that, quarter past four? Mm -hmm. Quarter past four in the afternoon, so <clears throat> I'm going to make that do me. I'm just like trying not to eat after a certain time. Is it about six o'clock? You're not meant to eat after six o'clock. <laughs> Well, you know the drill. 
If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified of future uploads. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Bye.